When the world was young, the land birthed many spirits. Some were powerful, like the great giants that inhabited the remote mountains, and others were strange, like the Qallubilluit that lived under the ice. But this old story is about one of the most feared of these land spirits. Suerte, suerte. Hey, Max, hasta luego. Hasta luego. Bueno, me parece que se lo ha tomado muy bien, ¿no? Supongo que porque no se lo he dicho. ¿Cómo que no se lo has dicho? Me resulta difícil. Bueno, ya, ya me cuentas luego. Es que te tengo que dar una notición. Tienes que hacerle que comprenda que... que... Amistad y trabajo son cosas que, coño, no se pueden confundir. No sé. Por la mitad. In Pie Town, New Mexico, the Pioneer Pie Shop is located between the stop sign and the gas station, down the street from the motel and within walking distance to a church. The Pioneer is where Kathy Knapp makes pies, and Kathy Knapp is the pie lady of Pie Town. I'm gonna take that highway, that old U.S. Highway 60 out beyond the big array. It's gonna be so nice when I find my slice of life. Take my advice and follow me to Pie Town. All right. Pie Town was, uh, I thought, was a, a joke. <laughs> People drive a long way out of their way to come to Pie Town. 
What's a special bit of what's left of the American West? I just usually tell them it's a wide spot in the road. <laughs> I think when people find a little roadhouse like this, it adds to their experience on a vacation that you can't get in a sterile food chain. No one here is here for the money. We're here for the quality of life and the pie. I think this woman makes every pie with love. And I think we feel it. Pie is something you put together with a few ingredients and a desire to please. And when you set it down in front of people and they enjoy it, you've given them something. You've given them a part of yourself. Oh, won't you come? Won't you come? Won't you come, come, come? Won't you come along with me to Pie Town? But you'd better make it hasty, cause those pies are awful tasty. Get some flaky, crusty pastry in Pie Town. But you'd better make it hasty, cause those pies are awful tasty. Get some flaky, crusty pastry in Pie Town. شعرت بالحياة بقربك لم أعد أعرف شيئا هل أنا أعرفك؟ I would sing like in church, my mother and father, but but I would never sing in public. I was I was very shy about it. You were different than most of the kids then, right? I mean, you dressed differently. All. Well, I suppose so by uh, normal standards, but it was just something I wanted to do. I wasn't trying to be better than anybody else. And like I said, I wasn't popular in school. I wasn't dating anybody at that school. And uh, the Interman and His Talent Show. And I came out, I did my two songs, and when I came on stage, I heard people kind of rumbling and whispering and so forth. Because nobody knew I even sang, really. And uh, it was amazing uh, uh, how, how popular I became in school after that. <laughs> I don't care if a hundred people died in this car. I want it. And it's all the same to you. I'd just rather skip the history. I'll take it. Off you go then.
कहा था तू और कैसा है मुझे क्या हुआ सही सही बोल तुझे कुछ ज्यादा छोट तो नहीं लगी अरे रात गई बात गई सुन मुझे तुझसे एक सवाल पूछना था कुछ क्या पूछना था तू हर रोज पाँच बजे कहाँ जाता है तू कभी मुझसे कुछ छिपाता नहीं था तो अब क्यों छिपा रहा है सर तू कितना ड्रामा करते है, है? ये कोई सास बहू का सीरियल है क्या चल तो मैं बताता नहीं तो मैं दिखाता हूँ memory every time you revisit a memory you change it the more you remember it the more it's reshaped like walking over and over the same stretch of sandy beach so if you lose a memory you're losing something that was always already lost like a wave in the water wait don't go my love This is incredible. We're really getting in the zone right now. I've got to tell you. Peter, you've done so much good work. Just calm down. <laughs> okay. Pretty please, come here. I do portraits here. Let me do one free. These two guys took a little interest in me. What else do you got in here? Go look. <laughs> Peter told us he had a lot more art at his house. I lived at the same home since 1941. What a mess here, huh? Everything I had was here. Walls all collapsed, ceilings all collapsed. He patched things up with pieces of plywood, like a fort that an eight-year-old kid would build out in a field somewhere. Okay, now, before I didn't like all that garbage, but the more I look at it, the more interesting it gets. If anything happens in this house and all your work yeah, is ruined, yeah. that would be devastating for you, Peter. Yeah. Right, yeah. Peter? Peter seemed like a worthy project. We could use our skills to help put together an exhibit. In the case of Peter Anton, wow. it was like a living artist, you know. I think Peter is the real deal. This is a big moment for you. I'm deliriously happy. It's going to be unique. We have a crate that is heavy with art supplies. Beautiful. Could also use a better walker. A walker needs a walker. You speak, I'm very dependent on you. You are my best friend. There will be bigger results than you'll have ever thought there could be. This man has a horrible reputation in our town. You should have checked into his background. So I head to the newsroom and say, can you pull me anything out on this person? Youth center operator held in raid. We freaked out. The first reaction was, the show must come down. Oh, if the artist is dead, we don't have to worry about if the artist is alive. Let's stay away from that. We have devoted years to this. I am not just a project. Those articles brought more attention to my home. It's unsafe. Where am I live now? <laughs> I think it's time for Peter to pull himself out of Peter. You don't want to bring what you're running away from here. The artist who suffers is common. It's called fortitude. It all started with a song. Lyrics about a man who was aimlessly wandering from one place to another. concept that foreshadowed a journey. What it became 
Dream was more than an album. It became a worldwide collaboration and a collection of experiences with strangers and with friends. But most of all, it became a lesson. Because sometimes, stepping out of your comfort zone and doing things a little differently can teach you a lot about who you are. And who knows, if you're lucky, you may just find something you never dreamed possible. Carly, something weird is going on. The lady that used to live here would complain about strange noises. And there's like a knocking noise, but I don't see anything. If you can't talk, just, just bang on something. Just let us know you're here. The ghost does appear. Horatio shouts at the ghost, says, stay! Speak! Speak! I talk to thee! Speak! Ghost? Are you there, ghost? Maybe we could be friends. You could use one, couldn't you? Holy crap! Who are you? Brian Flynn. You're the one that chased all those weirdos out last night. Speaking of which, I gotta go. Wait, Brian, I still have questions for you. Where did you go? Poker game. See you later. What if, Steve? Hello, I am Funanya, and this is our movie. It is a movie about a man, me, who is on a quest to find a beautiful princess he can rescue. Woo! Woo! Hello, my princess. You could be my princess. Oh. And his reward in the end is a kiss. A kiss? Yes. <laughs> You're kidding, right? Be a hero and win the heart of this princess. It's sweet, isn't it? That is our princess. I am sure of it. She looks like she needs to be saved. They're escaped. Patience of mine. With sexual delusions. So these loonies are dangerous? Uh, yes. The only thing that can save me is death. You want us to kill you? Everything needs to be tested. It must work perfectly. This is our big scene. Aren't you gonna help? This is pure cinema shock value. Definitely dangerous. Oh! Ooh. Ooh. I want these dead oh. found, and I want them back where they belong. Let's get out there and get to work. Drop the ball. Put the ball down now. Oh, Lord. Thank you for this meal. Do you have any hot sauce? Hello, Brad. This is Penny Marshall. I was just watching on one of these news channels snippets of this YouTube snuff film. I think it's big. I'm a little down to my luck. Yeah, I can see that. My daddy was a preacher. Stick around for a little while. Give us a little time to figure you out. 
past has way of catching up to you. The prodigal son has returned. Is it true that you can heal people? These good people need you, Connor. I saw a bunch of scared people. Desperate people willing to believe anything just to help lessen that fear. You can come home. We can be a family again. I remember the sort of home you made for us. Dragging me around the circuit like some sort of freak show. The will of God cannot be compromised. I just went to her and I laid my hands on her. You healed her? A miracle of faith is what she called it. You can't run from the truth, God. You figured out what's worth running away from. I mean, it's time you figured out what's worth staying for. She won't stop. It'll be just like it was before. The movie theater, the classroom, the abortion clinic. When the wolves come snarling at the door, blood is all that matters. We can be sure of the resurrection on Judgment Day. There is a war on, my brothers and sisters. I tend to pay attention to the tiny, everyday miracles. And the world's full of them. You just gotta get out of your own way sometimes. Oh. I gotta get out of here.